So hello and welcome to, well, I want to say a DVD store, my DVD store, but clearly this is my kitchen and I'm just pretending. These are real DVDs and this isn't a real computer, uh, it's kind of a little play toy, but hopefully we can give you an idea of what it takes to build uh, for OCR Nationals, DIDA, GCSE, even A-Level, what it takes to build the standard video DVD shop hiring database thing that most of you guys are asked to do. The reason for doing this one is because so far I would wager approximately 95% of students in this country get it wrong. So we're going to help you guys to put it right. Now, we're going to take a series of videos, a little along the lines of me just talking like this and acting a few things out with some children around the house. Uh, but it's going to go a little bit like this. I want to start off uh, by breaking down the database structure. I want you to imagine that the video shop hasn't opened yet. There are no customers coming through the door. All we've done so far, or in the process of doing so far, is putting the details of each of the DVDs onto the computer. So let's have a little look at our first DVD, but an old one now, a film called Borat. Uh, very funny, 15 certificate. But I want to ask the question, what information about this particular DVD would actually go onto the computer? Well, at its most basic level, we would say the title Borat, perhaps the certificate, 15, and, and maybe the genre, and by genre we mean comedy, action, adventure, anime, whatever you want to have. In this particular one, probably going to be a comedy film. But there's one final thing before we actually start um, going into the, the builder database is when you actually go to a DVD shop and you hand over your little card, then you hand over the DVD that you want to hire, what actually happens? Well, they take a scanner, a little bit like this, and they'll scan the barcode, and uh, probably won't make a noise like that, I'm not sure if you can hear it, depends if the microphone's picking that up, but anyway, they'll scan it, and you have to ask yourself the question, well, what is on that barcode? It's just lines. The name of the film isn't on there, the certificate's not on there, the genre is not on there. What is on there is just like an ID number for this particular DVD. It's going to be more complex than that when we're looking at copies, multiple copies of DVDs. But for the moment, we're going to go away and we're going to set up our first table. And the first table is just going to contain the DVD ID, the title, the certificate, and the genre. So let's go and do that now.